story that we're number 26 of an incredible lineage of films, and I think that we're trying to trying to teach you and, and, and take you somewhere you've never seen before. What was awesome when I watched it was yeah. it didn't feel at any point preachy, um, tokenism. It just felt like this is the way it is, and it was really comfortable and easy to watch. I'm wondering for you as a writer, how important was it to represent so many groups that normally sometimes do get marginalised or when they are shown, it's kind of a bit like a token, you know? I'm very familiar with that. I'm yeah. half Japanese, I'm half French, and I never really fit into any box, and that's sort of what made me fit in everywhere. And so for us, it wasn't even a question. From the beginning, we wanted to reflect the real world. The real world, people are different. There are gay families, or I was raised by two women. There are, uh, people are different. And I think that when you see yourself on the screen, it makes everyone understand that the world is a very different place, and that's the things that make it really special. Are you scared? Because it's so bold and so awesome, but being a risk taker yes. always means that you're kind of sometimes the first. Yes. So were you and Chloe having like group chats about, oh God, are they ready for this? Absolutely. I think every time you do, every time you make art, you're, you're you're inherently vulnerable. And I think that that's something you need to do. You need to wake up every day and take risks in your life, in your art, in your love life, because that's how you get what you really want. And I think that this is a film that was a challenge. It's a challenge always to make a movie. But in this one, I think audiences are going to find something different. And that's the question. We, are we ready for something different? I certainly hope I so. I think we are. My final question. Um, part two. Yes. Super excited. Yes. End credits that character it's oh great. my goodness yes. and playful and fun have you already started thinking about it absolutely as soon as we finish the first movie we start well, thinking about the second awesome. that said the fans are really gonna be i love kit yeah. he's such a sweetheart the fans are gonna be what helps decide if there's another one so go see the movie I, it really is something that we're we're from the beginning we dreamed about telling a story we dreamed about going off into the cosmos and exploring these characters so and with the god of love and sex yeah. without saying his name um he was quite playful and quite cheap in those yes. end credits. Can we expect more of that energy? His power is to make people fall in love with him, if you've read the comics. No spoilers. So I think that you just can go home and think about what that gift would be and, and how you might use that power in your everyday life. Perfect casting. Lovely to talk to you. Absolutely. It was a Enjoy pleasure. your premiere.